back with the Artie Lang Show. The great Maria Menounos is here, one of the hosts of Extra. Her new show, Chasing Maria Menounos, on the Oxygen Network. It premieres Tuesday. So you're, uh, how many episodes did you do? It's 10 episodes. Now, was there ever a time, like, when the cameras were in the house, like, were you just like, you're done with this? Were you just so, so frustrated? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, so uh, many times. Uh, how often are they there? They were there for like seven or eight months. It oh was my like God. legit. <laughs> and like every day? Every seven day. or eight months yeah, it was, makes it was, ten episodes? Well, when you want it the way we wanted it, yeah. yeah. I mean, we could have wow. banged it out in two months like other people yeah. do, but for right. us, like we really wanted... We wanted to capture that rawness. So, yeah, oh, no, trust main... me, so many times. Because I was working full-time at Extra, then doing that full-time, writing I mean. a book at That's the right. same time. You have a Jeez. book now? I have a book. I just turned it in. Um, Kevin and I did it again. Oh, good. Last week, finally. And so it comes out June 3rd. It's... Is it autobiographical? Or no, it? it's a follow-up to my first one, The Every Girl's Guide to Life. It's oh, now okay, called The great. Every Girl's Guide to Diet and Fitness. So. Oh, that's good. Yeah. All right, so Can when does that come use out? It? That's coming out June 3rd. June 3rd, right, yes. Yeah, so. yeah my, my, our guy over there, Boschetti. We, we have a guy who could use that diet and fitness concept. Hi, I'm Marie Helio. I just no, but it's for women, Hi. though. It's for women. But it, would, it, would it work for it Mike as well? It would work for anybody. I always say if you're secure enough to carry the book, it will give you plenty of help. Well, how do you stay, like, you know, the way you look? What do you do? I mean, what do you just do you exercise a lot? Is it, is it more that or is it more diet? Well, I always tell people that I'm a human tornado. Yeah. <laughs> and I do eat well most of the time, but I do indulge, and I, I, I'm not afraid of that. But I actually, in writing the book, kind of did a little study on myself. I yeah. put one of those pedometers on and really saw what I was getting for steps. And I average a base of 10,000 steps a day. Most days I'm at 18,000 no steps kidding. a day. Jeez. So well, I'm yeah. burning everything you I'm are. taking in. Well, you're a ball of energy, which is, you know, listen, I, I from hanging out with wow. you, you are not a girly girl. You don't, you're not afraid to let it, to let it out, you know, and, uh, but then you see, you burn it off. That's you're yeah. more of that type of thing. Exactly. And then if there's a slower week, then a little starts to kind of stick. Right. And right. then, you know, it balances off. Yeah. Well, it's, uh, I mean, like it's, I mean, it, to write it into a book and to, to teach people how to do it, that's that's a hard thing to do, I think. You yeah, know, and uh, all at the same time. Yeah, right, so, exactly, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, there are uh, moments where you see me, Kevin and I are fighting, you're like, is she just fighting about this or is she just <laughs> really mad about everything going on right now in general? <laughs> well, making a movie with you guys it was an interesting dynamic because you're there looking over your shoulder, but it, it works, it works because yeah. you sort of... Uh, complimented each other. Yeah. Do, do you think if you weren't busy, you'd go crazy? Do you, yes. you, think you, you need work, right? I, yeah, I yeah. think so. Because I remember even in high school, I always had like 18 projects going on at once. I was always around the clock. I love being busy and I love, you know, learning and being a part of cool things and Extra doing Extra curricular things. stuff. Yeah. 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 How much on, on your new show, did how much involvement did you have in, in the final product? You say... You had a vision for what the you editing, wanted to put yeah. out there. Mm -hmm. You wanted it to be good. How much? How happy are you with uh, the final ten episodes I'm, that you came up with? I'm happy with the final ten. Yeah, I think that we learned so much as producers on this good. that if we were to do another season, it would be even better. Um, well, I'm sure. And, I, and you know, listen, I got a feeling you're going to get there if if you want a second season. Thanks. I, you know, we have someone on the phone who wants to talk. Dean in California. Dean has a question for Maria. What's up? Oh, hey, guys. Uh, nice to talk to you guys. Um, two of my favorite good-looking people there. Um, uh, hey, Maria, I was am I involved? You, what, what type of uh, contractual commitment do you have to Extra? And would you ever consider going on uh, Howard Stern's uh, show for like a week or two to, to, to fill it for Artie? <laughs> <laughs> well, you're always good on the show. Well, I mean, you know, he Thank wants you. to know if you – would you like uh, – well, you, you're good on the show hey, on Stern. Yeah, we're you... going back, I think, in two weeks on the 25th. Yeah. Is that the type of hang where you think you could do, like, a show like that, like a crazy show, like, with edgy stuff like that? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> it's a different, uh, it's a different I think thing. Kevin could do that because, yeah, trust absolutely. me, he gets me in a hot, enough hot water in there. He does, right? Um, Kevin could totally have a great time with that. <laughs> so I will leave that to him. So now when are you going to find out about the second season? I mean, and that's something you want to do, right? Or you don't care? I mean... I think, you know, for me, I I never want anything to not be successful that I do. So I'd be sitting here being a complete liar if I was like, oh, no, I'd be happy either way. Yeah. Of course. I, who wants to fail or who doesn't want to succeed either way? But I mean, I'm, just saying, I'm not talking about it even failing. Like, is that something you definitely want to do? Uh, I think so, because right. I feel like, you know, like I said, you learn so much as you go through the process that now I'm like, oh, I 
could do it so much better. I, I see where things that I had ideas for worked. Yeah. And I'm like, so now I trust myself a little bit more. Right. With things, rather, you know, sometimes you always think that other people know better. Now whether you have it's confidence your publisher, in it. right. whether it's a pr production company, you're like, wait, I actually, I'm not bad at this. Like, I have mm -hmm. some pretty good ideas. Yeah, I did the second book too, and I had the same exact situation where I'm like, no, I, I learned from the first time I'd, to trust your instincts. Yeah. I mean, it's about you anyway. Uh, we're going to take a break. Do you mind coming over to the kitchen for the last segment? Let's do it. It's time yeah. to eat. <laughs> have a couple of... <laughs> All right, again, uh, the, uh, chasing... Can we get cocktails over there, too? <laughs> yeah, we got stuff. We got booze. I'm bored of the hot water. Whatever you need. <laughs> we got some angel dust crack. Uh, Maria Menounos, Chasing Maria Menounos is on Tuesdays on the Oxygen Network. I know it's going to be good. I'm looking forward to this. And uh, when we come back, we'll be in the kitchen. Back after this. The Artie Lang Show, weeknights on Audience, only on DirecTV.